August 21, 2024 marks a milestone in the annals of the Federal Capital Territory as Minister Yesam Wike marks his first anniversary in office. With President Bola Tinibu's renewed hope agenda as his guiding light, Wike has revolutionized the FCT, leaving an indelible mark on its security architecture, land administration, staff welfare, career progression, and infrastructural landscape. The day we come here, where the the Emma talks say no could do, I say okay, don't worry, we could do. Today, it they go on. So, make now tell people on our friends. So, we don't know my brother's word on now. So, we just have a beggar on our say, we gonna tell people we say they want go do protest. Say no be now. Eh? More than the patient give uh, President Tinibu some time when I go say things will change. No, we didn't do party here. This is not be party in Nigeria. I'm sure the council chairman for this area, na PDP, no be am. Hold on, hold on, hold on, man. Hold on. We're sharing there, right? It says we work together because that's for interest of everybody, not the interest of one party. But that is why we are working hard to see say renewed hope agenda of Mr. President say it come out very very well. So we're gonna support us to make sure say we achieve this. If we do this road now to Gwagulada, you go say the whole place go open up. Maybe I'm not going to have a fine. Not going to have a fine. Wicked security initiatives have brought renewed hope to residents. Town hall meetings fostered collaboration between traditional rulers and security agencies, while donations of fit to papers, vehicles, and gadgets have enhanced quick response capabilities. Motorcycles distributed to security agencies and vigilance groups have empowered them to effectively detect criminals, detect crimes, delay them, deny them entry, or defend the people, as the case may be. Come to talk about security. At least now, FCT is free from uh, bandit, uh, bandits. We are no longer hearing anything like that. Like uh, uh, places like uh, Ch uh, Chukuku here, that we are uh, Kujie axis of uh, in between Guagualada and Kujie along uh, Chukuku and Kii. Uh, then we used to have an uh, issue of insecurity, but now you can move even if it's one thirty a.m. Especially the the lapses, uh, the kidnapper issues, and the road. There's a lot of things that he has done. Things that we are not even expecting to, to happen and is happening now. He had cleared everything, especially in Gobe world, there was a kidnappers. In land administration, the minister has ensured transparency in the issuance of certificates of occupancy, protecting the rights of homeowners. His stance against illegal commercial conversions has enhanced the innocent outlook and scenic beauty of residential areas. Yes, we know that time grabbing is not new. Even some of the other people have started to reach. Staff of FCT are part of it. But as a government, We'll do all we can to see that we deal square with anybody that's involved. It doesn't matter how high you place you may be. Financial autonomy for the FCT administration has been achieved thanks to Wiki's persuasion of President Tinubu, allowing the FCTA to exit the Treasury Single Account TSA and to harness its internally generated revenue for development. Ladies and gentlemen, I am delighted to inform you that the FCT IRS in the first half of the year, from January to June, has collected and remitted the sum of $126 billion, we are delighted to state that our mid-year collection for 2024 is 53.5% higher than our mid-year collection for 2023. 
staff welfare has seen significant improvements with the establishment of the FCT Civil Service Commission, enabling career progression. We have been in FCT for years. Most of you are retiring as directors. You never had in mind that a day will come that you will get to the level of a permanent secretary. You never had that. It takes bold people. It takes people who are firm to implement certain policies or laws. And one of the renewed hope agenda of the President is to do things right. And that was why it took him that step to implementing the 2018 law regarding the establishment of civil service of the city. And what does that entail? By the grace of God, we will have a head of service. What does that entail? We will have permanent secretaries that will head various secretaries. just like what is obtainable in states. It was a big battle. Even when those at the federal level were trying to frustrate this effort of Mr. President. But I thank God Mr. President stood firm and said, no, we must allow them to be on their own. The establishment of two secretariats for women and youth has helped to address pressing concerns, thereby promoting inclusivity. First of all, congratulate the newest one in my secretary for the youth and the family secretary for the appointment by Mr. Excellency, Mr. President, and Commander in Chief for the Armed Forces of the Federal Republic of Nigeria. Today, promise made, promise fulfilled. <laughs> of particular note is the creation, the establishment of the Youth Secretariat. The Abuja residents, indigents, have clamored for the establishment of the Youth Secretariat by Mr. President. During our interface and discussions with the various area councils, we did communicate to them that Mr. President had agreed to, of course, establish youth secretary that will cater particularly for the youth. Infrastructure development has flourished under Wicke's leadership, with landmark projects like the Abuja Light Rail, Southern Parkway, Outer Southern Expressway, resurfacing of 189 city roads covering 57 kilometers, roads in Guzape, Wye Bridge, among others. Known as Mr. Projects, Minister Wiki has also given hope to the satellite towns and rural dwellers constructing at least two roads in each of the six area councils within the scope of the 2023 budget. More roads are being constructed under the 2024 budget. The period of abandonment of project is over. No project will be abandoned under this administration of Aswaji Bola Ahmed Tunibu, who has mandated me and the Minister of State to take care of FCT. FCT people, this is your own turn to benefit. We will not be tired of coming to meet you from time to time. In fact, if there was a, any way to relocate and stay with you and understand how you feel, we will do it. Wiki is doing the best in FCT here. At least, let me start from uh, road infrastructure. 
if you can look at the roads Wiki is constructing, go to the six area council. I witness like Kuje, Guagualada, and Kwali. Just in a couple of short period of time, the roads are being constructed. Right from inception, we have not gotten a minister like such. Um, why I said we have not gotten a minister like Wiki, um, in respect to, we look at the road. The road in the federal capital, we are having challenges, we are having bad road. There was no road in Abuja here. Um, you look at the work he has been doing, it has been a tremendous work. You look at the Kuji Area Council, he has, he has tied all the roads. You look at Guagualeda Area Council, look at Amak, he has reformed the Abuja Municipal Area Council, the sixth area council in Abuja. He has actually tied the road. Minister Wike also recently presented staff of office to four graded chiefs in the territory, resolving chieftaincy disputes that preceded his administration. Working with the Minister of State, Dr. Maria Mahmoud, a first-class medical practitioner, Wike has regularly engaged traditional rulers in the territory, according them important roles to ensure the stability of their domains. Traditional rulers have a lot of role to play. You are the closest to the clerk, to the grassroots. You interface with the people more than us. You are the one who know what the people feel at home. You are the one who will tell, who will tell us whether government is making any impact or not. It is you. You will convey to your subjects what government is doing and what government is about to do. You are the one to say government programs and policies to your people. If you convey a wrong message, that's what the people will accept. If you convey the right message, that's what the people will uh, accept. So you play a very pivotal role. While Wiki has renewed focus on schools and healthcare facilities, it is to his credit and Dr. Mahmoud's that the recent outbreak of cholera and Lhasa fever did not make incursions into the FCT. Wicked's achievements have earned widespread recognition, contributing to the relative calm in the FCT, even in testy moments. As Wiki and Mahmoud mark their first year, residents and stakeholders look forward to a legacy of continued progress, one that even his worst critics will in their private moments give a thumbs up. <laughs>